Yang Shumei is doing a bit better than most of her neighbours in Rentai Hamlet, and much better than a few years ago. Nowadays, she can provide a much more varied diet for the household she shares her cave with. Husband, three children, and 84-year-old grandmother. Not like when she was growing up. In the past, a family of more than 10, like mine, didn't have much to eat, and the food was terrible. Now, we have more variety, things like beans and rice. But there's still the daily grind, literally, of peasant life. Yang describes the never-ending round of farming and eating as a living, but not much of a life. <laughs> but she's cheerful and uncomplaining. At 37, Yang says she has no particular hopes for herself beyond eating three square meals a day, but hopes her children will do much better. The Youngs can offer their children a little more than most of their neighbours. As well as farming their own land, they run a small shop at a nearby village. Extra income from the store means they can afford a third-hand tractor and a black-and-white television. The television has broadened Yang's horizons, bringing images from around the world into her cave. But Yang's life is still tightly circumscribed by the demands of her daily routine. She's still never been to Yen An, a half-hour car ride away. Robert Stern, CNBC Business News, Shanxi Province, China.